This is private property, okay? Yes, sir. By passing my lobby and going up to the floor without a key, you committed felony trespass. We had a key from that the is felony trespass. You are not guests of this hotel. Yee right. yee, guys! Last night was an absolutely insane night. It got so hectic and crazy that we just felt like we had to sit down and narrate it just so it made sense. So basically the plan was we were gonna go to a hotel, ding dong ditch eight doors at once and then run and then film the reaction. But as you can tell by the title, things got a little complicated. Yee, Yee guys. guys, welcome back today. We are back with Pierce from the Juke Squad and his friend Troy and there's a hotel right there. And last time we did this prank, we were at Playlist Live. We ding dong ditched or knocked on seven doors at once and then we just ran and see what people did. But this time, we're taking it up a notch. We're ding dong ditching eight doors at once but we only have four people. So that means two doors each. We're not even staying in this hotel so we're gonna have to sneak in there and just hope that security doesn't kick us out. We're walking in right now, gotta keep it low key because I think security was just at the front. Hi, in that elevator. Ooh. What floor do you guys mean? All, all, all of them, all of them, all of them. Oh, Ooh, 15, all that's a good them? number. Come on, bus. We are now in the hotel right now. There was a guy standing at a desk to our left, but we just walked right past him into the elevator and now here we are, boys. Where are we going? Oh, shoot. There's literally nowhere to run in here, guys. No Except for the ice room. If we go in the ice room. But if anybody comes out and we're in the ice room, <laughs> that's gonna look so sketchy and boom, busted. <laughs> and then we're getting kicked out of this hotel. Hopefully that doesn't happen. And then right as we were about to ding dong ditch the eight doors, some Yee Yee Nation members came up to us. We talked to them for a little, and they actually had an aunt who was staying in the same hotel and they wanted us to prank her. So we went to her door to ding dong ditch her instead. Woo! We met up with a bunch of fans. They watched the vids right here. Yee Yee Nation. They know another person that stays in the same hotel, so we're gonna prank them with the mask. So they just told us their friend's room. It's number 806. So Troy's gonna get them with the mask. Hopefully they open up. Yo, they have the key. So Troy's just gonna open it and walk right in. Hello, room service. Oh my god. <laughs> Gigi, I found the YouTuber that I watch. Leo, why would you do that? As you can see right there, the prank on the auntie was a big hut, hut, hut. We were like, we cannot end on that. We have to go to a different floor and do the eight door ding dong ditch. And right as we were about to do it, we see security come out of the elevators. And this is where things escalated and just got completely out of hand. Yo, 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 get on here, get on here. Guys, a worker just came up here. I know you're in here, guys. Come on. I see you. Come on. I'm about to get his neck. I gotta get the neck real quick, though. Okay, come on. Can I get the neck? No, come on. Get that out of my face. Thank you, sir. Can I get the neck? No. No neck today? I'll slap my own neck. Yeet. We're getting yeeted, boys. Where's the yeeting nation? Little Yeeterson Peterson for the buddies. Security, they've already warned already once. They're knocking on people's doors and scaring them. No one has out. warned us yet. Security's probably looking for you right now. Robert, can you walk down with these guys? I want, Absolutely. I want security to talk to these boys before they exit and don't run because I've already called the cops. I got my okay. track shoes on All just right? so you know. All right. All right. This yeah. is ignorant. That's my donkey. Yeah, I got your donkey right That's here. That's a donkey. Don't, I want you guys what? in the elevator. Take it easy on the donkey. Yes, down. feelings too. You're being stupid. Yeah. Stop. Go down. Yeah. You're disrespecting me. And make I'm sure we're leaving, man. You're disrespecting you're her. You're not gonna leave point. until you yeah. talk to the cops. Listen, you're disrespecting her now. Stop. Just keep we're your going okay. Just be quiet now. You disrespected her now. She was disrespecting the donkey. Okay. Parmesan, cheddar, and uh, Swiss. Swiss? Big time Swiss. So we don't want to cause problems. So. Keep that recording on the ticket. Here we go. Why are we being cool? I don't know. There's no problem. We're leaving. 
Okay, let's go. Right. Then they were disrespecting Wanting to talk to the manager. We were, talk we were doing it. Disrespecting me. This gentleman is lying. You know, we were talking he was about saying, friends. excuse me. And they're videotaping me as well. They're videotaping everything. We did it I on people that we know. That. No, you were standing right here, videotaping, talking when Kevin, our bartender, yes, after you stopped us. We after you stopped us. Where are you Shh. staying? We're not, we're not staying here. This, the, the, our are fans you are local? Staying here. Yeah. Our fans are staying here, yeah. So then we met up with them, and then they they were going to prank their auntie. We knocked on it, and then we like scared her. Okay, but so I want to know why you were up in our rooms. Because that's where, that's where they, they were. They to come upstairs and scare the auntie. Yeah. So that's why we were moving. You guys disrespecting them? Yes. No, I, don't, I, I, was, I didn't say anything. Yes. 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 I didn't say anything. Alright, I got three employees that are contradicting you guys, and you really think I'm gonna believe you over them? I can I can show the video right here. This yeah. is ignorant. That's my donkey. You're being stupid. You're being stupid. You're being stupid. Oh, I'm gonna be honest with you right now. Sorry. This one here. Sorry. Sorry. This one here has got that's the not Sorry. Sorry about that. Sorry. That's the last thing got them off. Right there. Because you didn't let us. No one let us explain ourselves well, first. Simple. Let me put this out to you, okay? All right, no one let us explain this. This is first. private property, okay? Yes, sir. By passing my lobby and going up to the floor without a key, you committed felony trespass. We had a key from that the That is felony trespass. You are not guests of this hotel. All right. We didn't know that we couldn't go up there with a key of our fans. You they are not guests key. of this hotel. You have no business being on this property. I had property. no idea. I did not know Number you were allowed one. to do that. Number two, you, know you banged on a hotel room. person you were looking for on the floor? Mm, no, they just take What them. room is this person in that you... 806, we pranked him. You can ask him. So water, you actually... You want to call and ask if that's what they're on to? All right. Make sure we get a solid story out of this. You want to step over here? With the rest of them, oh, yes, sir. Thank you. The four six elevator right there. If you're going up, and down. Thank you. Yeah. yeah, here with Kevin. Another one down. Seriously, dude? Yeah. Hey. I know, right? You need to. What's your name? What? What's your name? I don't appreciate being recorded. It was a picture of us, sir. No, this is part of property. There are no video cameras allowed. Sir, that's a phone. Gentlemen seem to be playing games tonight. One's wearing a mask. They're banging on the doors looking for a room, scaring the guests, and stuff like this. Alright, are any of you staying here? No. no. Alright, so you're just out doing your Duke Squad thing tonight? Yeah. Our, the fans the we met up with fans in the elevator and then yeah, we went the to the room. The yeah, it's all our bad though. But you were, you've already been kicked out once and now no, we're no, no, we no, not been kicked we out. Haven't. We need to come downstairs and I get your information. Basically right there, we were doing the ding dong ditch inside the hotel prank and it went wrong. As you can see, cops got called and what? security got called. <laughs> then they had to bring the cops in. They basically took all of our information. Bada bing, bada boom, they had to yeet us. But we had to do it for Yee Nation, guys. We had to do it. And now we're not allowed back there. I don't know if I recorded that, but we're not allowed back at that hotel unless we buy a room. Comment down below if we should buy a room there. Woo! Thanks to the Island Boys squad out there for uh, watching. Subscribe. Yee Nation, new. actually. Yee Nation. Subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. Hey, you already know. So those were security knowledge. guards. Security guards cannot touch you, cannot tell you what to do. They can pretend like they can tell you what to do, but when it comes to security guards, just leave. Like, if a security guard's like, you're waiting here from the cops, I'm like, oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> so that is words of wisdom from the veteran right there, Jack. He already knows. Yee, yee, ha! Look at my down. Look at my tail. Oh, oh. <laughs> and right after we filmed that clip with Jack from the Juke Squad, all of his links will be in the top of the description. An employee from the hotel came across the street while Nick and I were trying to get drinks inside of a store. And he was literally like, what's your YouTube channel, bro? What's your YouTube channel? Like super like angry though. And I was like, I don't want to tell you, bro. And I don't want to rat out my friends. I don't want to tell you. And he was like insisting. He's like, bro, what's your YouTube channel? I need to know. And I was like, dude, I don't want to tell you, bro. And he was like, all right, as soon as you step out of this store, he said he was going to beat this thing right here. Yeah, that. He said he was going to beat it. So Nick and I grabbed our drinks. We skirted to the car and then we skirted home. The guy did not beat this thing. Luckily, we were fine. We made it home safely. Everything's good now. I know this vlog was like more intense than our vlogs normally are. And today we're going to be doing like super fun, exciting Super awesome stuff. Thank you guys for watching to the end. We really appreciate it. And if you're wondering what we're wearing the whole time, these are IVP hoodies coming out soon. It's got Yee Nation on the sleeve, guys. As soon as they come out, you guys will be the first ones to know, especially if you follow us on social media. We love you guys. And until next time, Yee Yee!
Wait, stand up, bro. Stand up. 